to Chilacita, and most of the olive oil production comes from this particular area in Argentina. This is 3,000 feet. Station number one, and there are nine stations up to... Up to 14,000 feet. We're in Chilicito, and there was a very, very important gold mine here from 1904 to 1926. And they built this cable car to go way up there into the snow mountain. It was an actual gold mine where they had to labor into the mountain itself. And um, I asked whether or not people are still looking for gold, and Maru said no, because there's this big discussion about pollution. The pollution is caused by the cyanide used to melt the gold, in, or shall we say in the gold manufacturing process. I had a flashback when we were talking about uh, the cyanide. In one of my videos, I think it was Indonesia, perhaps heading to Flores, one of those places, the locals were digging out gold and pan washing it and then using cyanide. And I remember asking our guide, aren't these people afraid to use the cyanide because of cyanide poisoning? But I guess if you want to make a living or eck out a living, a little cyanide poisoning is worth the risk. Can't even imagine it. How did the wa workers just sat in this? Okay, no, they work, I mean, trade also because they had to build with the mules and they have to carry all the stuff up there. So many people die during this building. It was built, uh, designed and built by the, the Germans. The, the British, they were the concessionary in charge of the mine. So those uh, things, they were for the doctors and people uh, engineering. The workers, they had to go up there with the... On foot or with their mule. In other words, you had to be privileged to be able to ride in the cable car. This because is the water right here. Some stations, they were not water, so they had to carry also the water up there. The open wagon was for the uh, mineral, the stones. So they just melt part of the stones at the second station. There is a melt oven. And, but normally it was just a stone. They put it inside and then here, we are down here, it's just the, like a garage huh, to repair. Yes. There, over there you can see, so they open, they turn, here you have hand. Mm -hmm. Up there they turn it and they put it down. And just keep just going. Straight to the, to the train. Passed by train tracks that are no longer used. And it was built just to carry the gold to Buenos Aires. There is a small museum in Chilecito, but today is May 1st, and Argentina celebrates Labor Day on May 1st. To lubricate the cable, and outside it's a place to fire. So they put the fire because up there the oil and the grease you could freeze. get the Would freeze. It's 35 the kilometers, this cable car. 35 kilometers, can you imagine it? And I forgot to mention that it's called Chile Chilecito because the workers were Chilean. They needed a lot of workers, so they came from Chile. The cable car is called La Mexicana, just like Mexico, but they don't know the reason why. But I still can't get over the fact that it went 35 kilometers. It would take four hours on the cable car to go the 35 kilometers. Station number two was the first motor station and the only to have a branch that allowed transport of the minerals to the blast furnace down in Santa Florentina. No mountain is called Florentina. The very fertile valley is called Florentina and where we're going to stay tonight is called Florentina. Tells all about it, 35 kilometers long, nine stations and it's a National Historical Landmark. Engineer, the big engineer with the steam. Let's move all the... Careful, right? Mm. That's some belt. The caldera.
Well, cars are run by steam. Okay. From here. I write. You can smell the sulfur. I'll show you there are many sulfur stones. All this yellow is sulfur. The river down there is yellow because of the sulfur, which of course was extracted along with the ore. The snow mountain is very important to the valley. That's where their water comes from, and if they continued using cyanide to get out the ore, it would absolutely kill and pollute all their crops. And the people, they're drinking water. Here is good. <laughs>